morning. It is Tuesday, October 20th, and today we're starting off on a dry note, and thankfully it looks like we'll stay that way for most of the day. However, rain doesn't you know stay away for long. We will see showers return overnight tonight and carry over into the day on Wednesday. So enjoy the dry hours while they last. This is a live look outside in Lansing just outside the Fox 47 studios uh, right along I 496 where it's currently 36 degrees. We are off to a pretty chilly start out there this morning. Most locations seeing temperatures right now in about the mid 30s. Definitely going to need the jacket before you head out the door. Right now it's 36 degrees in Lansing, 37 in Mason. It's the same in Jackson, 37. Also the current temperature outside in Charlotte. It's 36 degrees this morning in Marshall. For today, just a little bit warmer compared to where we were yesterday, but still below average for this time of the year. Highs reached to around 52 degrees under partly cloudy skies this afternoon. Rain again returns as we head overnight. Lows drop down to about 46 degrees. We'll see scattered showers starting at around 10 o'clock or so, and they will linger kind of off and on through the overnight hours and at least probably through about 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. So our satellite and radar. That's kind of what we're dealing with. We do have that stationary front station just kind of off to our southeast. However, we are kind of in between two systems right now, so we should be dry for today. However, that stationary front will lift, get into motion as a warm front later tonight, and that will again bring with it that chance for a few showers through the overnight time frame. Our future track as we go hour by hour. Thankfully for today, for the most part, it will be dry, at least through the daylight hours. If you need to go grocery shopping or mow the lawn, really anything like that, you have the time to do it. Temperatures will warm into the low 50s this afternoon. Clouds return this evening and that will be followed by a few scattered showers starting at around 10 o'clock or so tonight and they will continue at least off and on through the overnight hours and then lingering probably till about seven or eight o'clock tomorrow morning. I think by eight, most of the rain will kind of be wrapping up. And then from there, at least for a few hours tomorrow afternoon, it looks like we will be dry. Temperatures will be warmer tomorrow, reaching at least into the upper 50s to near 60 degrees. Clouds return Wednesday night, and then it's kind of a copy and paste kind of forecast where we'll see a few showers move through Wednesday night into the day on Thursday. So here's a look at the next seven days where again, it's not going to be a washout, but we'll see a few showers tonight into Wednesday morning. We're dry Wednesday afternoon. Highs reach into the upper 50s. See another round of rain late Wednesday night through Thursday morning. Temperatures on Thursday expected to reach to around 70 degrees. We should be in the low 70s on Friday, so it will be rather warm, but it does come with a chance for a few scattered showers starting Friday afternoon and continuing through Friday evening. That rain associated with a cold front and we'll really feel the impacts of it as we head into the weekend. Unfortunately, temperatures really only reaching into the upper 40s, around 48 degrees. The expected high Saturday and Sunday and the rain Again, doesn't stay away for too long. We'll see rain return Sunday night. It will carry over into the early morning hours of Monday of next week and temperatures stay again below average highs only in the 50s starting off next Monday.